Hey guys, I'm Tyler and welcome back to Day to Day DIY. Today we are going to make a door frame for the new shop. You guys are not going to believe how easy it is to make these door frames. I used to get them from the local store like many of you guys probably do whenever I needed a new one. Outrageously expensive for the simple couple boards that they are. So when we moved into this house and built the shop, we had a nice insulated outdoor door that I wanted to use for this shop. I got a couple boards that were left over from some old workbenches that I pulled out of here when we built the new space. So we're gonna make this door frame for the new shop out of completely upcycled material. Let's see how it's done. The hinges, when they're stacked up correctly, protrude from the door about a quarter of an inch, 0.26 or so. And we want this to recess into the frame a good bit so we get a nice tight seal against our weather stripping once we put it in there. So I would say we want to probably recess down about one and a half widths of the, the hinge itself, which is about 1.6. Maybe we can go three sixteenths of an inch is what we'll go for. And that's it. That was actually more than just building a door frame. I actually installed and hung the door on that one as well. Simple project. I actually spent zero dollars on this except for the new handle with a lock on it. The old one was a little bit janky, wasn't really reliable, so I wanted to replace it with something cheap so that I knew I could get into the shop when I wanted to. You saw I added some spray insulation around the outer gap so that we can totally seal in the shop, keep the humidity out, keep the nice AC in. Hope you guys enjoyed this day to day. If you did, please hammer that thumbs up button. Helps us out a ton. Hit the subscribe button right down over there so you never miss when I upload a new video. I'm DIY Tyler. You guys have a good one.